Andrew Wyeth, born in 1917, had a unique life that greatly influenced his artwork. Growing up in Chad's Ford, Pennsylvania, he often explored the landscapes and rural areas, finding inspiration in the simplicity of nature and everyday life. This connection to his surroundings is evident in his early works. Take the bobsled from 1937, for example. Wyeth captures the excitement and energy of children racing down a hill on a sled. You can almost hear their laughter and feel the rush of the wind. It's a moment frozen in time, a snapshot of youthful joy. In After the Rain from 1939, Wyeth shows us the beauty that comes after a storm. The sun peeks through the clouds, casting a golden light on the dew-covered grass. It's a peaceful scene, and you can almost smell the freshness in the air. Another noteworthy piece is Pirate's Chest from 1938. Wyeth's fascination with old objects is evident here, as he portrays a weathered treasure chest. The texture and detail in this piece draw you in and make you wonder about the stories and secrets it holds. Tending to the Vegetable Garden from 1936 reveals Wyeth's admiration for the hard work and simplicity of farm life. The woman in the painting is diligently tending to her garden, a symbol of nurturing and growth. It's a reminder of the importance of connecting with the earth and providing for oneself. One of Wyeth's most iconic works, Man and Dory from 1937, showcases his ability to portray human emotion. The lone figure in a boat evokes a sense of solitude and contemplation. It's a quiet moment captured on canvas, inviting us to reflect on our own inner thoughts. Wyeth's fascination with rural landscapes is also evident in windmills from 1936. The towering windmills against the vast sky create a sense of awe and wonder. It's a reminder of the power and beauty of nature. On the Glenmere Road from 1937 captures the timeless charm of a country road. The warm hues and soft light give a sense of tranquility and nostalgia. It's as if you're taking a leisurely stroll through the countryside, soaking in the beauty of the surroundings. Morning, Little Caldwell Island from 1938 invites us into a peaceful coastal scene. The calm waters and gentle fog create a sense of serenity. It's a moment of stillness and reflection. Across the Bay from 1938 showcases Wyeth's skill in capturing the play of light on water. The shimmering reflections and dynamic brushwork bring the scene to life. It's a reminder of the ever-changing nature of our surroundings. Finally, Low Tide from 1938 depicts the ebb and flow of the ocean. The foggy atmosphere and sense of vastness evoke a feeling of mystery and timelessness. It's a moment of quiet contemplation, inviting us to ponder the mysteries of the sea. Through his experiences and observations, Andrew Wyeth was able to create a body of work that captures the beauty and simplicity of everyday life. His attention to detail and ability to evoke emotion make his artworks timeless and captivating.